everyone. Today it is, um, I think it's the 24th of April today, 2023, and um, it is 21 um, days until the first GCSE, not mine, but in general. Um, and yeah, so like I just said, three weeks to go until the first GCSEs begin. Um, and today I'm back with some homework, not revision, I don't really want to do anything. I've got no motivation today, but we're just going to plough through and do some maths homework that's due I think Friday. Um, but yeah, let's jump into it. Hi guys, it's 10 minutes past 9 on Tuesday the 25th of April 2023. And although I've got my GCSE started in three weeks, I did not think today. So, let's go to Wednesday. Hi guys, um, here's a bit of a dilemma for you. Um, it is Wednesday the 26th of April 2023 and look this. Yeah, I'm going camping this weekend. Yeah, I'm going camping this weekend so like there's going to be like barely anything for me to really say for this next week. Um, so I'm leaving it down to Ollie Boom. Hopefully he leaves stuff if not I might have to shout at him next Monday um, tomorrow I probably won't really do anything because I've got to set up everything um, and then Friday I'm camping Saturday I'm ca camping Sunday I'm camping till midday so I might be able to do something yeah um, but yeah I've done nothing so far so Hi everyone, it's the morning of Friday the 28th of April 2023, um, I didn't do anything yesterday, like, in terms of revision or literally anything, I did nothing. Okay. Hello guys, it's Ollie Boom back again with more revision, I'm actually doing it this time which is completely different to last week, but here's what I've been doing today, so we've got some Harry Potter stuff because I wanted to do some English revision and I found that this has stuff like adjectives, nouns, pronouns, uh, all that kind of sort of stuff. Ron is great at showing how I feel when I don't understand a subject. Another thing I've been doing is catching up my business coursework, so let's have a look and I'll show you how much I've done so far. So if we look up here in my components, each five of these, they're all different um, different subjects you have to do in business. So this one is about my um, definitions and being able to understand different terms. You've got my own example of a survey. I've used McDonald's as an example. Component 1A was using two businesses already chosen by the school and defining how they work with um, customers and going into depth about how they um, advertise their business. Same with component C, but that was more of an in-depth version of component A where I've added like about maybe five or six more pages to it. Also here's some examples of past papers you can do for business. So for example, I've finished this February 2022 paper. You get, this is what you'd be given in a test. So you can see all the, so they give you scenarios. So this one's we scoot to you. Then they'll, be, they'll have a couple of multiple choice questions. I've got 100% of all these when I did it myself. Uh, then you've got a couple uh, giving examples of the like the types of marketing and all that lot. And then if you go a bit further down, you get given these graphs where you have to work out the opening balance, the outflows, inflows, all the kind of um, money related issues that a business might have. And I'm already reaching halfway through my goal for today. 600 XP in one day, I'm already at 270. J'adore regarder Iceberg 303, c'est le meilleur YouTube. I promise he gave me no money to say this, but subscribe. And here's an example of a scenario card where they'll give you a picture. They'll give you a couple of questions down here. And then if I turn it over, these are the things you need to respond to. So as you can see, I've already had mine marked. So I've got the first few questions right and He's asked me, like here, he's asking me to add some stuff so I can make it better. And he's 
saying I, all I need to do is really condense it to make it easy to remember, but most of it is easy and already correct. You've also got the other questions, because at one point you have to ask the examiner questions about French, so here's all the no normal commonly used phrases, so you've got stuff like how do you get to school, what is your age, who is it for, all those kind of questions. I've also got a French test coming up on this Wednesday, so I've had to revise all of the different sentences, so these are all examples of what could be asked during the exam. So I've had to write down my own responses and I've meant to memorise these so that I understand what it will be asked on the day. And of course this is a lot of stuff so I've got to get my memory in check. Um, so we're back now guys, um, it is like 5 to 1 <clears throat> in the afternoon. It's taken me like 3 hours on it, but like I'm very slow with this. Um, I'm still not done. So yeah, I had to like write a new book of work, but this is literally during like a little bit of time. I don't know how long now, but like, yeah, this is it's taking quite a while to do. Um, yeah, I had to like write about, what was it, I think it was how um, parents, the parents are used on things that like changed, and how like they don't let their children do whatever now. Um, yeah, picky parenting, you know, it's like the best thing I can do. Yeah, um, we're going to finish this and do something else. Um, hi guys, today it is Monday the 1st of May 2023. Um, 14 days until the GCSEs begin. Dog, shut up. Mm. Yeah, um, so Friday, Saturday, Sunday, I was away camping, sleeping, and that was very interesting. Um, but today I'm back, we're doing more... GCSE revision with those exams, yeah, for two weeks at the time. Um, and, but the thing is, today they've got English homework due in in about an hour's time. So I'm just going to have to quickly do that before I do anything else. Um, and then we'll just like be doing other stuff. This is going to be a long day. Hello people, hello um, Apache helicopters, hello trees, whatever, whatever life forms I'm talking to. It is still Monday, 1st of May 2023, and I'm done. I did, I did that homework thing. There was more, but I just couldn't be bothered, and I'm going to not do anything else now, because, yeah, there will be something tomorrow. Um, hi guys, and welcome back today. Um, look what we're doing. Oh, specific latent heat. Um, it is time, um, when, uh, no, 10 minutes to 6 in the afternoon. Say. Um, I've done like four pages so far today. Very proud of myself. That's probably the most I've done in ages, considering the exams are in two weeks. I'm not going to complain. But the issue is the fact that I've got like six units left. Or, oh, no, not six units. I've got like nine plus. I think I've got 11 units left to do. I don't know. I haven't really counted to be fair. But yeah, I'm pretty sure I've got nine, 11 units left to do. And the exams are in two weeks. Yay. I will get this done though, I swear. I've also got like other subjects to revise for. Maths, because I've done like none for that. Uh, geography, I've done like two pages for. Uh, English and media, I've done like nothing. So I should probably start revising them as well, considering the exams are in two weeks. Oh, well, we're gonna finish this first. So, the, basically, the plan to finish. Uh, let me zoom in again. Uh, so, I've got latent heat there, and then I've got like eight or so, or no, seven or so, like things to do um, for this. And also, as you can see, I've done like courses already. I'm literally saving electricity and magnetism for the last, like, two nights, three nights before the exam because, boo, about, like, any of that, if I walk into the exam and I've, like, revised this for a week. Also, I forgot to say, it is the, uh, the 2nd of May now, um, but you probably already knew that. Um, but yeah, um, thanks for this. Um, I don't know why I'm saying thanks for this because, like, uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye! Okay, so I finished 
some stuff. I think I finished P1 thing. Um, and now I've finished that before. No, it's like half six now. Um, so we're gonna just like go with the flow tomorrow, considering it's like gonna be 13 days until the first exam. Um, also, Oli Boom has his speaking, his French speaking exam tomorrow, so we got we gotta get a review on that tomorrow. Um, but yeah, this is me signing off for uh, Tuesday, the second of May, twenty twenty-three. Come on. You've got to go again, Philly. What are you doing? Right, Shut up. Hang on, I need to line them up and then it will go. Oh, what are you doing? I don't know. There you go. Do you want me to show you? Hello, people. It is the time. The clock there. There says something is like. 10 to 10, um, I've done nothing today, um, but this is the end of today, or this video, part 4, um, so yeah, there's like a lot of stuff that's happened, like, a lo like an another load of stuff that hasn't, um, so the plan is to rectify everything that hasn't happened in the next few days, like 9 school days now until everything starts, so, well, it's not even that, it's like 7, but yeah, um, I will see you in the next video, which will probably be uploaded like the day before the exams will start. So, um, yeah, bye.